come together, certain combinations create certain effects. something that was written by somebody but it was actually heard and received on an intuitive plane and that that's what makes it really interesting it was passed on over centuries because they carried a certain intonation they carried a certain pronunciation they carried a certain strength and this was passed on orally Savitur Vare Inyam Vare Inyagum Savitur Savitur Vare Inyam These Vedas, they carried hidden messages or truths and knowledge that was why I say hidden is that they were actually behind the words. So when you see a Sanskrit mantra and literally translate it, there is one meaning that you arrive at. But in reality, the meaning of that mantra is deeper than the physical meaning of the Sanskrit words. So when one progresses on the path, one perceives differently and so when you begin to perceive differently those words literally become symbols to deeper truths that are actually hidden behind those words and so this was a way that they also preserved this divine knowledge and it was passed on the human voice can sing lovely ballads it can sing love songs it can sing bhajans but actually the mantra is the chant which it connects to that deeper soul which is almost like the origin of where you're born and where you're going it touches that very strongly so that's the unique experience that one gets when one actually chants these mantras Prachodayadi prachodayadi. 